Imagine brain development like the construction of a house. When building a house, a construction process has to happen that sets the foundation and stability of the house for the following years. Now, when there is an error that occurs in these initial construction processes, this can ultimately negatively impact that foundation and stability of the house. Similarly, brain development must also undergo a construction process that consists of a series of events that are important to ensure the foundation of the brain and also ensure for its stability over the course of a person's life. And just like a house, if there's an error that occurs during these initial developmental processes, this can impact the brain development by leading towards abnormal brain development and eventually lead to neurodevelopmental disorders that we know of today. In my lab, I study one of these foundational processes, specifically how energy is produced by cells over the course of development. By being able to study these foundational processes, we can identify the key events and steps that are necessary, that are necessary for a brain to form and function properly, as well as identify the origins of neurodevelopmental disorders.